Hello everybody. Hey. Welcome to this Hi. video that we talked about or Dawson talked about doing for the Boba Fett film. If you've already if you're watching this now, you've probably already seen it. Welcome to day one. Yeah, of this is the making of the set. Yeah, it is <laughs> just to give you all an idea of what day it is, it's January 15th. Um, I don't know when this video is gonna be coming out, hopefully soon, but like I said, if you've already watched the film, then you're watching this right now. And we are currently at Walmart. We're getting some stuff for the, the set. Yeah, we're with the gang here, and uh, we're about to go in there and find some stuff. It should be very interesting. Yeah. We found all the cardboard. Yeah. These are um, these are the biggest cardboard that they got here, but they're not as big as they need to be. So. These are gonna be like for some of the wall things, but um, at my dad's work, he has really at mine too, but mine's all the way incoming. Yeah, and uh, uh, you saw it with the pirate thing. Well, you didn't really see it with the pirate thing, but y'all saw it on our Snapchat stories that we got yeah. really, really big pieces of cardboard that's gonna be for the wall. So this is gonna be for more like smaller details, or um, if we need to put more walls in it, that's what those are gonna be. Yeah. Yeah. That really brings up that kind of stuff is um, I take a like a Walmart bag yeah. kind of thing, or like any like an Ingles bag, mm -hmm. and I take the base coat of it and I spray it all down, and then I get black and I spray over that and I dab that thing and it gives it that like oily kind of um, right. broken down texture. We got some paint. We got some paint. If you want to see, we got. Um, we got some nutmeg, we got some gray, we got some London gray. <laughs> What's we got all the grays. <laughs> and then we picked up this thing, which will be a, like a nice little thing just to put on the walls and on the ceiling to bring out like some of that weird stuff that Star Wars has. Yeah. We got thumbtacks weird somewhere. Stuff on yeah. Oh, and I also picked up, y'all didn't see this, but I picked up two of the medium boxes. So. I saw that one, y'all oh. coming away. Trying to get the cardboard situated. We just bought all of this, and now we're having this problem. Well, it works like that. It works like that, but you're going to hit your head on it. Awesome. Huh? We bought all of this stuff. And it was like twenty-two dollars for him, thirteen for me, and then she paid for her the other stuff. Speaking of that, how much was all that spray paint? Paid more than we did. And that's why me and Trace are going to be splitting all the stuff at Dollar Tree. Yeah. Because it's going to be a lot more cheaper there. Yeah. We're trying to get these in there now, and we did it. A lot easier than we thought. Jesus Christ. <laughs> we are at Dollar Tree, the place where I used to work. And we're about to go get some cheap stuff. Oh, oh. Look, I'm crippled. I'm crippled. I don't care. Not very crippled, but. Putting some vines and some thingies. This is right here. I don't know what they're called. <laughs> I, out. I used to work here, it's fine. I know the manager. All right. Now you're dropping. I know the That's manager, I already and that. he works here, so we'll be fine. Mm -hmm. Do you need one or two of those? Yeah. I don't even know what I need it for. I didn't say that to work. Well, I know. We're going to Waffle House now. We got some Dollar Tree stuff. We got a lot of Dollar Tree. Stuff. A lot of Dollar Tree stuff. Um, I think. Hey. Cody. How's it going? Going well. How are you? Good. How about you, bud? Awesome, see you bud. I didn't know Cody worked there. That was Cody. <laughs> I got him on camera. Uh, but we went there and he bought some stuff. He still works here. That's so you know, do I know some people that don't? Is that Colin? Why does he work here? Why do you work here? This dude. He can't hear you. So 
So another segment of the whole, the making of the set part is I'm gonna show you all a couple of different things of the soup because I'm getting things for it. Right now I'm gonna be painting the Boba Fett gauntlets real quick. And I'm also gonna add a cool thing to the gauntlets. Boba Fett doesn't really have this, but I thought mine would because it's a younger version. On the right thing, this is an Assassin's Creed hidden blade that I took off and I'm gonna attach right there. And we could probably add in the scene where the blade comes out and Boba stabs someone in the neck or something. You know, so here's a cool thing of me painting some stuff. Hey, also another thing I forgot. My awesome brother-in-law, Jesse, 3D printed a bunch of these credits. And I'm about to spray paint. And I already ordered, I ordered a bunch of them. And now he just printed a bunch more too because he has a 3D printer and they're really cool. And we'll use them for the film. So this is also the thing that I'm going to be painting. Welcome to my work area. I'm gonna talk about Boba. So this is the Boba Fett helmet I made, but I did it right. Cause a lot of people buy a Boba Fett helmet and make it. This helmet wasn't originally a Django Fett helmet, and then I painted it and now it's Boba. And that's exactly what Boba Fett did. So I did it the right way. Anyways, but yeah, this is my Boba Fett helmet. I actually got, as you can see, there's not the big dent in it like Boba Fett does because it's a younger version of Boba Fett. Put the visor, you get all the battle damage, like a couple of things of battle damage, and everything like that. So, a bunch of scrapes for the battle damage parts to make it look a little bit more realistic. I took a wood engraver and I melted the plastic to where it gives it that 3D effect of like there's actual damage on the helmet and everything. So, that's cool. That's cool. So, now I'm gonna put some other coats and tape some things. Now we're getting everything that we got. Look at all the cardboard. <laughs> Stuff that could halfway fit into the car, back of the car. Did you ever hit your head on anything yet? No, it wasn't. It wasn't coming out far enough to where okay. it hit me in the head. It looked like it was about to hit your head. No, nah. no, nah, I was, I was good. He was good. Yeah, we paid a combined, um, I think. Um, 30 like 34 35 dollars yeah for um, both of the for all this because you at walmart you paid like 17 no you paid like 13 13 and you were like 22 mine was 22 and that's, then that's at, 35 dollars mm -hmm. and then uh, if y'all want to know if you want to do this yourself and then at then caitlin all the spray paint was like 30 something 33 i think she said yeah Plus the tax, and then, um, not tax, like tax, <laughs> like dump tax. So that means that's like $68 altogether. Yeah, and then at Dollar Tree, I spent like $16, $17. That's uh, same here, I think. Yeah. So, yeah, we overall, spent Overall, we lot. spent like l under 100 I'll do my best to add it, and it'll be right here. <laughs> I'm pretty sure it was under 100 Yeah, but... It'll be on the screen so they'll know how much if, so they can do it themselves. If, if you you'd wanna, like. If you wanna build a whole set. Yeah, if you wanna put the time and effort into building the set. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, 
Look at all the stuff that we got at Dollar Tree. Too. Yeah. It says it right there. Right. <laughs> right there. Where's everything? So, I already got one gauntlet put together. Cool, right? That's the right hand one. The little thing, it's all dirtied up. And it's held together by Velcro on one side. But one thing that I'm gonna do that's adding on is I'm gonna take my wood engraver, like I did with the helmet, and start putting in scratches and things. But before then, um, so me and Trace doesn't wear any fumes, we're gonna put some face masks on, like, him, he's over there. Yeah. He's wearing a face mask, so everyone's good and safe. Um, mine's Boba Fett, so it's fitting for what we're doing. So I'm gonna do that now. So I just did this gauntlet. Um, oh boy! You can see how there's a bunch of uh, white stuff because the gauntlet is white because of the plastic. But there's all the inventions I'm gonna do. Now I'm gonna go inside and paint it, and you can see how I paint it. Here's my paint station. Right here, I'm gonna use just normal black paint. And then this FX armor metallic paint that I got. This was actually pretty expensive. There goes the dogs. So now I'm going to paint. So that is it for day one. Um, yeah, I'm about to go home. I'm like standing right in front of my house. Um, we got some stuff done today. Not really anything with the set. Dawson got the uh, Boba Fett suit parts of it. Yeah, I um, so I just finished up the gauntlets that you saw. So far, all I have with the suit is the boots, the weapons, the helmet, the under flight suit, the belt and gun, and the gauntlets and gloves. All I need now is the actual armor pieces and the basically just the armor pieces and should be good. So and but, you'll get to see that later in this video. Yeah. And um, next weekend. This was day one for it. Next weekend is going to be more of like the blueprint kind of day of like figuring out how things are going to be placed and probably like building a couple of things on the site. Yeah, and we're going to, that'll be next, well for y'all it'll be coming up right now, uh, but for us it'll be next weekend. And so, yeah, that's going to be it for day one. Yeah. And uh, we'll see you in day two. In day two, January 22nd, it was the... Uh, I don't remember the date, you have to watch it, go back and look because I can't remember. But 
You're here today. Oh, there's Alma. I am in your book now. <laughs> yeah, we're with everybody today. No one's here again. We got Dawson and his dog. Yeah. And then I'm here. <laughs> I'm just here. And uh, we are, what are we doing today? So today's going to be more of a blueprint day of like talking about the set and blueprinting everything out and drawing everything out and measuring everything to figure out the dimensions of everything and today I might work on the door, the sliding door. Yeah, so we're doing that today. More of boba. Yeah, boba. Yeah, there's all that. You take a look at that. Cause he got all this stuff on day one. Well, not, all not all of it, but most of it. And this is what it looks like so far with bare feet. And yeah, it's looking like this right now. But yeah, we're doing that today. And yeah, this is a part of it, apparently. So, oh, no, they got that on camera for the first time. <laughs> but yeah, we're doing that today. And yeah, we'll see everything. So it'll be pretty cool. This is the area. So on back wall one, for width, put seven foot four. I got that on camera. For height, put seven foot one. <laughs> so another thing in part of the set was I know we got real credits now. Come, friend. Come. <laughs> I got real credits. These are the ones that you saw me painting just a little bit ago at the beginning of the video. Then you got little ones, you got big ones, silver, gold, brass, other brass, imperial credit, but we're actually mostly using the Republic credits. And on top of that, got actual uh, Sabacc cards. So it just brings more of a realism of this is Star Wars. So we're, uh, we're getting top notch on this. Yeah. <laughs> You know, more realistic, more realism. Star Wars. Now we're gonna start blueprinting. Hi. <laughs> um, about to do a bunch of blueprints and everything. We're about to see, do a time lapse and we're drawing everything out and figuring everything out. She's over there, writing a bunch of the specific stuff. Doing whatever. Trace is over here. Filming. And he actually helped out with the credit stuff, even though it was completely pointless because nobody. I think I if things you up, look at you it. Things up. Yeah, it I mean, if you look at the credits, it's kind of common sense to be like, oh, that's more expensive than the other one. Yeah. You so. know. We figured it out, but now we're going to start working on the inside of the bar, the blueprints. So we're going to do that. And mess up again She'd rather be burning it all now I know we will end up in anger I don't think we grew up We just became older She's aiming her words ready to fire I don't think that bullets will bring back desire I don't think that bullets will bring back desire Bring back
sidewalk. You're wondering what this random red stuff is. It's going to be graffiti that's on the wall. And then this black spot that's going to be like a window. I'll probably put like a piece of fabric over it. Um, all the gray that I did is like the under walling. And all the hard, the black is of course the, um, the extra pieces that are going to be attached to the wall. And just some other little details. Like you got width, 7 foot 1 inch, 7 or 6 foot 10 inches, and then for the first side, because there's a beam that runs through here, you got seven foot, four inches, and on the other side you got 13 foot. So, I just got one of the blueprints done. I gotta do the rest of them, but um, I got a bunch of my inspiration on just like a bunch of things that I found off the internet, like looking up Star Wars walls, cantina walls, um, how to do this, how to do that, and I sent them to Trace, and here's some of the pictures right here as I'm talking and whatnot, and um, yeah, so for the rest, I'm gonna do the rest of the blueprints, and then the show to <laughs> I finished blueprints. Right here, we're gonna be working on the door. So this is the blueprints I got for the door. I didn't do it with black marker. There's the door. There's the inside panels of the door to give it just a little bit more dimension. Then this is the mechanism of how we're gonna do the sliding door. We got cantina. It's simple enough. Just wall, wall, inside. You got the inside of the doorway. All the red and blue is a bunch of graffiti outside the door, blah, 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 broken down wall. We've got uh, the front. Oh, no, wait. This is the side. This is the side wall, which is on the other side, like a little window thing that's right there. And then there is the front. So, meanwhile, it's basically going to look like that when it gets put together. See? Yep. There we go. Now, I go and work on door.
food. We got food. Yeah, we got food. And the dogs want food. Well, it's day two of making the door. Iron blueprint stuff. Yeah, we did that today. We didn't finish the door. Yet. No, we just did what it's going to look like right now. The, yeah, the base the of it. The base of it, yeah. And that's basically it at the moment. Hello. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, we're done with that today. And we'll have to figure out what we're going to do next, I guess. Yeah. <laughs> on day three of this video. A lot of time lapses on this video today. Mm -hmm. And not that much to edit, but you know, it's day two. What else do you, can you expect? Um, that was day two. We're gonna end the day today, and we'll see y'all on day three. Yeah, we'll be in day three. <laughs>